Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Soy from the Classy Sassy Life. I know, where have I been? Well, I have been sick. My family has been sick. I've been out of school. A lot has been going on in the month of February. So I am super excited about March. So I thought I would start this week off with the Plan With Me video in my teacher happy planner. You guys know I have the classic size happy planner with the pencil on the front. So I'm not ready to plan my monthly quite yet because our newsletter has not come out for school. So I'll be doing that this weekend and uploading it on Sunday. So make sure you check out for that. So I'm just going to be recording this week, the 25th through the 1st. So I'm going to go ahead and pop these out and get started. Okay, so at the beginning of the year, I created um, some headers, um, and I will post a link to that video. I had never taught first grade before, so I wanted to, um, I need to go in and make new headers, but I'm not going to worry about that this close to the end of the year, so I will probably just um, make new ones for next year. And I just tore that up, so I'm not going to be able to use that one right now. But I will show you how I'm going to repurpose that. So, okay, I have my headers. And, of course, I left my black pen that I love to use. So, I'm going to use a different pen today. And I'm going to go ahead and stick with this, like, green theme that I have going on. So, I'm going to grab the two different shades of green that I have. And these are the Amazon Basic Pens. I will leave a link to those down below they are supposed to be a paper mate flare dupe they're pretty close they're not like head on but they definitely work I have that green pen there and i'm trying to see if i have a black pen that i like to use and i do i have a zebra pilot these are one of my these are my favorites these are the z grips and i want to say they're a medium tip so anyway, I'm going to start with reading. So reading and then um, guided reading, of course. I'm going to go with grammar and writing here. Writing. Math. Guided math. science and social studies all right so now that I have my headers I am ready if you guys know last year when I planned in my planner I like to put where we go for specials but our special is the same every single day so I'm not really going to use that for um, that particular purpose so I'm just kind of flipping through to get an, an idea for what I want to do. Um, I love these focus stickers. They're very pretty. Let me show you what they look like. These are for appointments. I love this sticker here. It says the best teachers show you where to look, but don't tell you what to see. Um, not, no... Um, holidays this week that I know of and I think that's all I'm going to use out of here right now okay um, so let's go to reading and I'm gonna start there with my planning um, well, we're starting a new unit on Monday and it is um, all about sequencing and we have, um, let's see, we have sequencing and um, visualizing. And there's one more thing that we're doing. I have to think for a second. Sequence, visualize. Compound words. So we have sequencing, visualization, compound words, and adverbs. Um, that's all the things that we're going to be covering. So I start my grammar units. I tend to start them on, um, Tuesdays. It's just easier. Okay. 
Okay. So these are just going to signify my main teaching points. And um, I'm going to also notate my independent practice with an icon, but it won't be from this sticker book. And I am using the Target sticker books that you can clip into your planner. Um, both of them are a teacher. It's a blue one and there is a red one. Okay. And I am indicating independent practice with these little icons here. So. And then, and my little heart kind of flipped up a little bit, so. I'm going to just pick it up with my blade and lay it back down. Going back through my red sticker book. And I know I'm giving a quiz here. Um, I need to another icon typically I start a new grammar lesson on Tuesday but this grammar lesson um, is extending from last week so I'm going to finish up on Tuesday and quiz on Wednesday so there we go for that okay so now I am ready to do a little bit of writing after I lay down two more stickers for my new lesson. And because I'm switching, I am going to switch the icons that I'm using. It'll just make it easier for me to know that I'm not working with the same thing. Even though I'm gonna write it, it'll be easy to visualize where the change happens. zoom out a little bit so you can see what I'm doing all right so now we're ready to do some writing so we're gonna read our intro story we're gonna be introduced to our spelling words high frequency words and vocabulary words On Wednesday, I want to do high frequency word sentences. Student made. Um, so we're going to reread our story. We're going to do number one in our trifolds. And so, of course, we're going to review spelling words, vocab, and high frequency words. And we're going to sequence the story. All right, so then we're gonna do a new read. We're gonna do number two in trifold. And then of course the regular. And I already have my independent practice there. We're gonna do a reread in groups. We're gonna do number, that's gonna be my independent practice number three in trifolds and we're gonna do a flip book activity all right and then we're going to do a partner read and we are going to review 
And we're gonna take an AR quiz on first. Okay. Oh, and we also have fluency, high frequency word review. All right. So in grammar, in grammar, we're still working on C and saw. We're gonna do our anchor chart. And we have a worksheet for independent practice. We are going to um, review C and saw, and we may do a scoot activity. I think my kiddos really like that. We're gonna do a worksheet, and then we're going to review quiz C and saw, and I'm going to introduce adverbs. We're going to do an adverb um, review, and then we're going to do an activity, and then there's an adverb activity that I want to do, but I cannot think of the name on it, name of it, so I'm going to put on Friday hands on adverb activity. All right, so I have my grammar and my reading. Let's go ahead and do math. So we're gonna have a test on math and math on Wednesday, and then we're transition. We're gonna keep continue to review, and we're transition to a new unit on um, Monday. So I'm gonna use these little hearts to indicate what we're working on. Let's see, we're gonna do 4.4, 4.5. Yes, I skipped today, it's a four reason. Here. And I have to move a little fast because I'm about to lose my camera. And then I'm go I changed my mind. We're going to test on Friday. Chapter four. All right, so we're gonna work on 4.4, 4, make, making 10, and then subtracting. Um, we're going to do that again Tuesday, then we're going to work on 4.5 and we're going to work on 4.6 and review here. Okay. Um, for science and social studies, it's going to be fairly simple this week we are working on a did you know activity for social studies so i'm going to have that going on all week so i'm just going to make a line from here to here and did you know we're also going to be doing um read across america but we are going to be doing um, I, in, not in celebration of Dr. Seuss, um, but we're rather going to be following, like, it's an Instagram activity, um, books that I saw, and I will post a link to that post. Um, I don't have it back here with me, so I'll fill that in later with the books that we're going to be reading. Now, this over here is my miscellaneous activities, anything that I see that I need to print. Um, and just by looking at everything, I know I need to do print a scoot, if I can spell, scoot activity. Um, and I hate the way that looks, so let me show you how you repurpose a sticker. So you remember we had this green sticker in here that we tore. I'm gonna pop that out. I'm gonna lay this right here. And I'm going to put a little star icon right on top of it to kind of hide that little tear. And you can't even see it. And I'm gonna write right over it, scoot activity. 
print to the bowl. Um, I want to work, I want to do some fact fluency. Subtraction. Ones, twos, and threes. So I need a data wall for this. And I need to start sight word data wall. Race to the top. You want more details about these particular items, make sure that you um, click that subscribe button so that you can see inside my classroom. So the final thing that I wanna talk about here is guided reading. We're gonna do some phonics, passages. Um, we're gonna do fill in sentences, word building, and reading and we're going to actually be doing that all week for every single group so i'm not going to rewrite that over and over again here we're going to be working on subtraction and we're going to work on each skill so from three two and one um making tens um the other activity is doubles minus one and then review before our test okay so that's pretty much it all i'm going to do now is add just a little bit of you know prettiness to my page here and we're going to be done so let's see I love this wake up teach kids and be awesome it's a little strip here so I'm gonna lay this at the bottom um, teaching is a work of heart these are so thin that they will definitely fit right under here and they are perfect and I am getting this out of the red sticker book now I also have some old sticker books like this green teacher sticker book that I have really went through today. Um, um, went through over the years that I've had it. I think I've had it for about two years now. Um, celebrate every tiny victory. I love that. Hmm. No long weekends coming up. And I basically use everything. Oh, yes. We have been drowned in rain. So I'm going to use this sun, please, over here. And before I forget, I need to also make a note to do March door. gotta get that done um yep and let's see let's go on the gold star quote see if we can find a little bit of, of motivation oh yeah actually i can teachers need lots of motivation guys if you're not a teacher you may not understand but if you are you know exactly what I'm talking about. Passion changes everything. Love it. I'm going to put that here on this one. And I think that's all I'm going to use. Yeah. Yeah. So I think that's all I'm going to use. So that is going to wrap up this plan with me guys i hope you enjoyed it thanks so much for watching keep god first in everything you do do not forget to hit that subscribe button and that bell so you don't miss a video and remember to plan a class in sassy life guys bye